Hi, I'm Austin. Welcome to another demo of Manaflow. Today we'll be using a template called the Product Price Comparison. This will basically take in a product URL and compare it with competitors. So on the left side, you have a chat interface where you can make edits to the Mana Sheet on the right. Let's actually expand this Mana Sheet. So we're going to open it up. Um, so each of these columns have a different set of instructions. So you can see um, some of them have you know different cells. Let's actually just populate yeah all of these different links. So we have lows. Home Depot, and then let's do target. And let's do a quick execute. So now we can go more in depth. So each of these columns have you know, a set of instructions and some of these instructions are either calling tools or referencing other columns. As you can see, all of these uh, rows and cells are actually running. And we can look at, we can take a look at all these different uh, instructions. Um, yeah, so basically we have a set of you know tools. You can do slash to get a look at all these tools and commands. And then you can use at to get all the referencing of the columns. And these can be like past data. You can reference you know other columns so that you're able to get the data that you need for a specific column. And for example, this product page is using a crawl markdown tool so we can look at it so it's using the crawl markdown tool. we can actually just type it in and select it and that's how we can use the tool to fetch the markdown of a website so we can take a look at some of these runs so we have a SERP full tool which is a google search of a tool of a potential product is on title and then we can figure out what are the other variants and vendors that are selling the same product so we can actually look at this tool. So there's a public directory of tools that you can use and call. You can also create your new own tools and you can use natural language to make a tool. Let's go back to product comparison. So as you can see, some of these rows and columns have been uh, successfully populated. We can see one of these is retailer price link in tabular format. Um, you can actually click on some of these links because they are in Markdown and you can check to see what the products are. Um, some of them have a better price than what we had originally on Home Depot, which is really cool. Um, you can take a look at what happened. So there's a is same product that we call to make sure that uh, both the sites are, the, are referencing the same product. Otherwise, we don't want to do the comparison of the prices. So this makes sure that um, both sites are have exactly the same product. And we do that by you know taking you know, screenshots of both sites and making sure the comparison of both are exactly the same. So it takes account the image, also takes account the title. Yeah, so this thing is going to take some time to run probably because it's comparing a lot of different sites together. And so eventually we'll get a good list. But on the, on the meantime, we can actually go to this chat interface and actually make a new column. So let's make a new column uh, that maybe tells me whether I should buy or not buy. Yeah, so action by, uh, yeah, de determine whether I should buy it or not based on like the price. So we have an original price versus the best price. Yeah, the best price is from the competitors. So I only want to buy if the original price is lower than the best price. So this is like basic logic. You can just throw it in all your logic and it's able to create this new managed sheet column. And you see on the right, it's actually made the by decision column. And now we can execute these three rows. And these three rows will have essentially is run and it will automatically determine whether you know, original price is less than best price. And yeah, that's our demo. Thank you.